I'm going to be making freckles today, like um, fake freckles using makeup. And I watched like 30 YouTube videos on it, so I'm basically a professional. I've always thought that freckles were really, really adorable, and every time I put them on, I really enjoy it. And you know us girls, we always want what we don't have. Naturally, I have blonde hair, my hair is straight, and what do I do? I make it dark brown and I make it curly. So. So if you want to try having freckles for a day, or if you're doing a Halloween costume or stage makeup or something like that, or even if you just want to throw a few on for the day, this is how you can achieve that. So for me, I am using what I use for my brows, and that is the Anastasia Beverly Hills Dip Brow Pomade. And this is like a gel slash cream. I think what would also work is a um, cream eyeliner. Yeah, eyeliner eyeshadow, like anything creamy or a gel consistency would work. Also, if you don't have either of those things, then I think you could use a brown mascara. And it's going to be the same procedure, basically, for each one of these products. So for mine, I'm going to be using this product, and I'm going to take a tool. It doesn't really matter what it is. I just happen to have this. And it doesn't have to be an actual tool. Like, you could use a little brush. You could use whatever you want to use. Um, and just take a tiny, tiny drop of it, like you can't even see it, it's very microscopic, and just place it on your finger in the shape of, you basically want it to be in the shape of a circle or a freckle. So there's my little tiny, tiny dot, and I'm going to put this dot on my other finger. So now there's two, and these are going to be my little stamps for my freckles, and I'm just going to kind of place them where I would want my freckles to be. Just like so, and they're kind of dark right now and prominent, so to kind of like fade those a little bit, I'm just pre pressing them in with my other finger, and it kind of helps to set them too. So yeah, um, you can continue to apply a little drop of the product and keep snipping them on. And when people naturally have freckles, they're not just like a little bit on the nose and cheeks. They kind of spread up into the forehead, um, maybe even around the chin a little bit. So just, you want this to look natural. You don't want to make it look like you stamped a couple of freckles on your face. So f freckles naturally don't have any sort of pattern. So you might want to put them where you normally maybe like wouldn't want freckles, like maybe right in between your eyes just to make it look like you didn't put them there on purpose. I can only be coordinated with one hand at a time, so that's why I'm doing it like this. So that's basically how you want to do it. And when people have natural freckles, they're all different colors. They're not just one shade. So if you have two different products, that would be preferred. Um, if you're going to buy makeup specifically for the purpose of making freckles, which you're probably not, um, I would recommend getting this product in, in the blonde color because it's not actually blonde. It's like a medium ash blonde brown which is perfect for freckles and any skin tone so you want to make it like probably no darker than your eyebrows because that would look kind of ridiculous freckles like I said they don't really have a pattern and there's no rhyme or reason to it so make sure that if you're applying them you don't want to do it like perfectly spread out because that, then it will look too obvious um, if you wanted to incorporate this into your everyday look like going to work which if you're a weirdo like me then you probably want to do it like a little bit at a time like start with like three to five freckles one day and then you know continue to do that for a little while and then slowly work your way up to um, lots of freckles I wouldn't go overboard with it because then you'll look cray cray um, but yeah I just thought this was fun and cute and I really enjoy freckle faced people and I wanted to have freckles myself so I decided to go ahead and stamp them on my face and yeah I realize that this isn't for everybody, but there are a few people like me who would like to have freckles, and I wouldn't recommend doing this if you can't handle people asking you, like, hey, did you have freckles yesterday? Like, are those fake? Um, if you can't handle something like that or people saying something like that to you, then 
don't even try this, but I feel like my uh, like coworkers know we know me really well, and they know I like makeup, and they know I like trying new things. So I'm cool with it. But if you don't want to deal with that, then then don't try this. Or if you're gonna try it, do it on the weekend. And once you see your face like this a few times, it really grows on you. I think they're so adorable. Like I love them, but that's just me. So. Hopefully you liked this video. If you did, don't forget to give me a thumbs up. And I am doing a giveaway soon, so all your likes and comments are going to be considered when I am choosing the winner for this giveaway. So just a little FYI, and I'll see you next time. Bye!